hey guys jbuilds here and in this video i'm going to be building some extensions for my table saw using 8020 aluminum extrusions i'll post a link in the comments to the design that i used and all the parts uh, but in summary i used 8020 15 series profile just because that uh, was the thickness of my table saw top which is an inch and a half so the 15 series worked out perfectly um, and I using the double anchor connector fasteners here that you can see that you tighten using the Allen keys and they provide the strongest connection um, so that was my go-to connector to use and I did use the existing holes that are already in my table saw top that you can see on the sides here so the only thing that I had to do was basically assemble these um, to the size that I wanted and then drill some holes to match up with where the existing holes are in my table saw. Now one side I made uh, about 14 inches long and the other one uh, about 12 inches long. And that's just my personal preference. If you guys decide to do, you know, go this route, you can always get your extrusions cut to whatever size you want. So that's really the biggest um, positive factor in, in using this, these profiles that, you know, you can customize it to any size that you want and it provides a really strong foundation and, and base for, for an extension. So once I have the extension assembled, um, I went ahead and confirmed that I had the centerpiece where I wanted it and drilled the holes where I would be attaching it to the table saw. And I'm going with 5 16 inch bolts uh, that are long enough so I can tighten it from both sides. And that's all there is to it guys it's a pretty straightforward simple design that's easy to assemble um, and like i said very flexible so you can design it to whatever size you need my plan is to use the right one um, i'm going to design a router lift for it so i can use my fence um, with the router and then on the left extension that i assembled my plan is to eventually design some sort of a uh, sliding mechanism and use that as a sliding miter sled so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and stay up to date with all my future videos. Thanks for watching.